Hey everyone, welcome to the official channel of the Tritris Monthly Championships. Every month the Tritris Discord community holds a competition known as the TMC, or the Tritris Monthly Championships, and we've been holding these competitions ever since March of 2021. I'm going to be posting all the VODs for the TMC on this channel, but before that I thought I'd give a brief rundown of the history of the TMC up to this point. So yeah, let's get started. Back in March, the game was only a couple months old. The competition was a lot smaller and it only had four spots for the tourney, consisting of the top qualifiers Chidori, Dreadnought, Ezra, and Oruk. We played on level 9 speeds and had best of threes for the first round, leading into a best of five final. Chidori and Dread would be the players to meet in the finals, and ultimately, Chidori would win the first TMC with a peak score of 781,000, impressively making it all the way to level 19, which was really rare at the time. Going into April's TMC, we changed the format to include an extra bracket to let more people have access to competitive games. We called this the Ninja Circuit. This allowed up to seven more players who qualified to compete in the tournament as well. We also increased the speeds we played on to match the skill we saw from the players. The ninja circuit was played on either level 12 or level 15 speeds, and the TMC bracket would now be played with the daunting level 18 speed. In a dominant fashion, Arrow would 3-0 both of their opponents in the ninja circuit and continue onwards winning the TMC title as well. They had a peak score of 744,000 in the ninja circuit, and later got to a 794,000 in TMC taking not only the TMC title, but also the record for highest competition score from Chidori as well. In May, the top players were making rapid improvements. Players were starting to earn scores over 1 million points known as a max out. By May's TMC, six players had earned a max, with others very close to achieving one. But even still, no one had gotten a max in a competition setting just yet. While JDC managed to take the ninja circuit with a score of 677,000, he was later defeated by Dreadnought in the first round of TMC. Dread would win the TMC for herself in a close set against Ezra, with a new comp record of 911,000, just shy of the first comp max. The June competition of TMC is when things really started picking up. We had 8 players who had earned a max outside of competition. During the qualifying rounds, Dread, Error, and L would all earn a max, leaving Ezra who got 2nd place in the last TMC, starting from the ninja circuit. And she made it all the way to the ninja circuit finals, and with some incredibly close games against JJC, Ezra won the ninja circuit with the first ever competition max, a very close 1.0 million score. But despite her amazing performance in the ninja circuit, her run would be cut short by Dreadnought in the first round of the TMC, who earned a staggering 1.7 million to beat out another 1.0 max by Ezra. In the finals for the month, both L and Dread would manage to earn a 1.1 million score, but it would be Dread who won the TMC and took the title for the second month in a row. July's TMC was a bit smaller, with only 5 entrants, meaning only a single match would be played in the ninja circuit. With a bunch of early top outs from both players, Rachel managed to take the ninja circuit to a game 5, winning with a peak score of only 184,000 points. Going into the TMC bracket, even though Rachel managed to get their first comp max at a 1.3, Dread had another impressive record-setting max of her own, this time with a 1.8 to take the match against them and move on to the finals. In the final, she would defeat JJC to become a three-time TMC champion. In a similar fashion to the previous month, in August, Rachel would win the ninja circuit with a peak score of 1.5, only to lose to Dread in the first round of TMC, who beat Rachel's 1.6 with a 1.7 of her own. This left an incredibly stacked final round, where Dread managed to get a new competition record, beating her previous 1.8 million score with a slightly higher 1.8, and Ezra's 1.7 wouldn't be enough to take the round. This meant Dreadnought would take another TMC title, making her the now four-time reigning TMC champion. For September, the game's creator Goal would end up taking the Ninja Circuit title for himself by breaking his own PB and getting an 863,000 score over Mopal. The TMC finals would again come down to Dread and Ezra, 
with a narrow victory earning two separate 1.7s in the round. Dredd would again take the TMC title and become the five-time TMC champion. In October, we had four players get a max out average in the qualifiers, meaning for the first time, a max out didn't guarantee a spot directly in the TMC. Elle would have to start in the ninja circuit this time. She'd still manage to make it back to TMC by winning the ninja circuit title with a peak score of 845,000. But yet again, Ezra would make it to the finals against Dredd in the TMC. Despite both players able to get maxes in the semi-finals, neither player would earn a max in the finals this month, and Ezra would take the long-standing TMC title from Dreadnought with a 939,000 Game 5 victory. The November TMC had a lot of players deciding not to qualify or just unable to play during the month, so that left goal as the Ninja Circuit winner without needing to play any matches. The many-time previous TMC champion Dreadnought was also not in the bracket at all, leaving Rachel as the first seed of this month after the qualifiers. Rachel would take the first round over goal, meeting Ezra in the finals, and the finals of this month would be extremely close with the most maxes of any competition set so far, with both players getting three separate maxes each. But Ezra would manage to hold her championship title, beating Rachel with a peak score of 1.7 in a close Game 5 finisher. Despite the low amount of entrance in the previous month, the December TMC was a great end of the year competition. Nichols managed to make it through the Ninja Circuit with a peak score of 385,000 to earn a spot in the TMC bracket with Ezra, Rachel, and Jelly. The semifinals would end with some early top outs from Nichols and Jelly, leaving Rachel and Ezra in the finals, yet again. Rachel would top out early in the first two games, but then they managed to come back and earn two victories against Ezra, leaving the final match of the year to a tense decider round. Both players played exceptionally well, shattering every competition record to this point, but ultimately Ezra would win with a 1.8 score over Rachel's 1.7 in the final round. And that's where we're at today. January TMC is set, and we're about to be in a new month of TMC very soon. If you'd like to try and play some Tritress for yourself, there's a link below the video where you can play, and there's a link to the Tritress Discord too, so you can learn from our active community, and maybe even compete in future TMCs for yourself.